Romans. What's the problem? What's the point? <laughs> who, who cares about Romans? We've seen them, we've been there, we've done that. Ancient Rome is just too outdated for today's documentaries. We're going to try something new. We're going to look at the truth. The truth behind the facts. The facts behind the facts. And the facts behind the truth. But what does this mean? Normally, it means documentaries with information and interviews and other such things. But, what's the point? Who cares about the truth? Maybe we do, but we only care about true facts. Who are facts? Who are they? We don't know. We're going to find out every single thing about facts, including facts more facts and truth. The only truth that is actually relevant is the facts. But are they opinions? Maybe. We don't know. There's lots of information, lots of things to do, lots of things to say. But we're going to be covering ancient Rome and Rome. But we're not in Rome, are we? We're in Britain, <laughs> but Britain sucks. It's just not, it's not good enough. It's not enough. There's not enough things to say here. I mean, look at all this grass. Who cares? What's the point? What, what did it even... What is, it, what is the point of this entire thing? This part of the documentary has concluded absolutely nothing, including how the ancient Romans just didn't give a fuck about this place. It, it doesn't even... Uh, doesn't have anything to do with the documentary or anything following the documentary, no matter what you watch. Well, actually, ancient Rome was responsible for a lot of things. Well, if, if you care about the truth, the matter of the fact, or the truth being the matter, is that the Romans landscape the landscape. They beard the beard, they wind the wine. They wind us up a lot, because we have history lessons about them. And they tell us a lot of things, like uh, Latin. I don't understand it. Many people thought of the Romans as morons, but I think we all know they were quite intelligent. But why were they wiped out? Who killed the Romans? More importantly, who killed the dinosaurs? There are lots of people that in the... there's lots of suspects. We've got the Gauls. The Gauls killed the dinosaurs. We all... that we all killed the dinosaurs. It was all our fault, thanks to the CO2 emissions and the global climate change and the warming of the globe. It wasn't until uh, 12 BC when the dinosaurs finally got their trial and Gaul, you know, they got prosecuted quite heavily and they lost a lot of money. <laughs> if a fact isn't a fact, it sure is a fact that it isn't a fact, but it's not a fact. So they, you need to get a fax machine and then combine them together, and you get a hundred facts, and then nobody has any because they're all muddled up together, and then nobody has the facts except me. And me, who isn't me, has an effect because that's a fact and you know it. Mm. There is one thing we can thank the dinosaurs for though apples. As we know, True facts have concluded that dinosaurs harvested apples. And so what we know them as today, apples. We're very fortunate and grateful to the dinosaurs. Well, you see, the fact is, the fact isn't really a fact. The fact is a something, but I don't really know because I had a guy who made the fact for me in like a fax machine and he, he didn't really know what he was doing so we got a kind of poorly designed fact and it's not it's not very cohesive fax as in a fax machine yeah well they're outdated well, there's usually 100% of facts uh, in a sentence, but uh, in this case, uh, they're missing several percent. So do you think facts as a whole are outdated, then? Facts or facts? The one you're thinking about. Well, that's an outdated fax machine. What about the opinions? Well, they're generally things I ignore. 
And then the civil war started. It was a big war. Lots of battles. Lots of violence. Lots of chaos. The dinosaurs weren't there because they were late. I mean, they were extinct. And the Gauls, all they were, they were the front lines. And it was all chaos. The thing with the true facts to, to me, Jeremy, is it, I feel like it comes from the soul. When people make facts up, you know, they take it out of their ass. that's from the bomb hole. It's not from the bomb hole. It should be from the soul. What do you think about the truth? It's the best way. The best way to... Get to the bottom of things. <laughs> He's done <nowhere> to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> it's because Louis was talking about bomb holes earlier. <laughs> Yeah. The truth is the only way, um, unless you're lying. That's what I think. Yes, that's what I think. What I really, really want to know is where'd you get a fax machine? And you can get one from me for 9.99 at 090706 Number two. <laughs> dot com. <laughs> what about the documentary? How did you think it went? Well, so far, I can't say it. It's rubbish. To conclude, or to rather not conclude anything, the truth of the matter of the facts, or the, the truth is, you know, made up of facts, and we didn't really find out anything. Thanks.